love is a carousel. I repeat, love is a carousel. Do you know what I mean? Love is a carousel. Yeah. Hey, brothers. Pull up a seat real quick if you ain't seated already. This is a message to the trad thought and the undercover feminist. Yo, look. Have you brothers noticed that we as manif Manosphere participants are getting pushback from almost no blatant feminists? You know those grown-up vaginal turds of the brawl-burning idiots from the past? You know those second waivers? But from those undercover feminists blanketed, heavily blanketed in traditional values. All right, She's usually in a marriage with children or a single mom talking all this tradcon shit. But her, her hypocrisy is showing under her apron and her dress. Dig it? See, she's going to talk the talk and speak on injustices to fathers and husbands in the court system. She's going to schmooze up to red-pilled circles and even back up claims with facts about the system. Okay, she's good so far. She'll even slap some makeup on turn on the camera, and make a video with red pills in them. But when you take the time to view her comment section, you'll see an army of tradcon string-along simp motherfuckers. See, what bothers me about them, you know, those trad thoughts and undercover feminists, what bothers me about them is that they waited until the current year to address feminist fuckery. When they were the ones throwing the rocks and hiding their hands for 60 years at a grand scale back in the 90s. I ain't forgot. See, this is nothing more than her climbing the rope ladder of social value and then burning the rope ladder after she's gotten to the top, effectively hating on her own sisters. See, this is why they brand these bitches with internalized misogyny. That's exactly what they want you to believe, though. You know what I'm saying? Coltane pointedly expressed, I'll link that in the low bar on that video, that there is very little, if any, difference between the woman that is married with children and the single mom in that the married woman extracts resources from the husband, whereas the single mom extracts resources from the government. So, in short... Make babies, get money, right? And speaking of money, it also reminds me of a 1936 film. I'll put a picture up. It's called Craig's Wife. In the film, its lead character is a controlling housewife named Harriet Craig, played by Rosalind Russell. She's a ruthless perfectionist who... Having married for money, married for money, sees her carefully managed world crumble around her over the course of 24 hours. Now, I won't spoil too much of it, gentlemen, but let's just say that if what happened to her in that movie happens to all married women today, they would probably have a legitimate reason for wig towel, <laughs> whatever the fuck that shit means. Anywho, it uncovers a deeper issue in the subjugation of men, even if they're traditional. See, isn't it funny how you see a traditional female claim to be sympathetic to the plight of men, but when we call them on their bullshit, you start to hear a lot of feminist talking points come out their mouths. See, it's almost like they were undercover trying to snag a husband. You know what I'm talking about? Allow me to address you again, Miss Traditional. I don't see you in a family court protecting falsely accused men. I don't see you at a picket line protesting for men's rights. 
I don't see you debating the mainstream media outlets regarding men's rights in real life. I don't see you confronting feminists in their videos or even your videos. I don't see you debating a wage gap myth either. All I see is some hubristic, narcissistic, bloated bitch from a steady diet of daytime television. So fuck off. There's my middle finger to you. Call me bitter. I dare you. See, my end game for going my own way is that the very last thought in my mind within the last beat of my heart is to know and feel that I went my own way. Yo, share it to men that need a red pill. Like it if you stumbled upon this video and made it this far. Subscribe and bang the bell if you want to see me again. Get on my bitch shoe, Zimp channels. You know it's up there. It's in that damn description. Go ahead. And donate to Veterans Outreach. Now, if you want to sneak diss on me about that, you best believe that I visited VFWs and POW MIA lodges. And it's also for channel improvements. I ain't gonna lie. Heh. <laughs> You want to hang on to that? I got you. I have a cash app and crypto, and no, I won't even angry Meg tell you. Not at all, brothers. Peace.